boss you there. We have a problem. The staff have found out everything that Emmerich's been up to. They're right on the edge. I need you to intervene before things get out of control. Get back to Mother Base ASAP. Nine years ago, this man acted as accomplice to the attack on Mother Base. He then provided support to Skullface. Conspiring with Eli, he repaired Sohalanthropus in secret. His research materials caused the leak at the quarantine facility, which in turn caused the Walbachia mutation, letting the parasites off their chains. We lost a lot of good men. He also stands accused of murdering one of his own family. Hiding the body. I haven't killed anyone. The rest is all wrong, too. The inspection was supposed to help everyone. I sacrificed myself for my companions just as much as any of you. Why won't you believe me? The prosecution calls a witness. Strangelove's gravestone. Haunted by her phantom. It's just a machine. Machine. You forced your own son into the cockpit of a Metal Gear, a test subject. How? His mother had to hide him away, and for that you locked her in that coffin. No! She, she did it herself! It was suicide! And even if I did, what right do you have? There's more. We have you to tell us everything you've done, everything you've thought, all this time. Nine years ago, you agreed to the inspection in return for Cypher's guarantee that you'd be spared. I thought it was real! We've reviewed into everything else that's happened since you arrived here. Please. Guilty! All counts. Kill him! Kill him! Kill him! Kill him! Kill him! We exist outside the law. What should we do, boss? Just give the order. We'll handle the rest. Prepare a life raft. Big enough for one. Good water to us. He's leaving. You. He's responsible for. for all of this! Think of all the men! He didn't lose a damn thing! This is the enemy! And he's here on his knees! Us. You are right. He is not one of us. But we are not responsible to judge an enemy. He leaves Mother Base, and that'll be the end of it. Touch 
hurt me. I'm innocent. You're the murderers. Snake, you should be in this boat. There'd have been no inspection if it weren't for your precious nuke. I risked my life trying to save you all. How can you do this? Am I the only sane one here? I... My... It's not my fault. Look, you can't discard your phantoms forever, Doctor. Son of a bitch will make it, you know. I can see it now. In no time, he'll be telling tales about the black-hearted diamond dogs. The shining white knight, blabbering on about our injustice, hiding behind his fool's idea of morality. And all the other fools will stand around, nodding with every word he says. No. One day he'll see through the lies he's built up, realize what kind of man he really is. What goes around comes around. You can't run from yourself forever. Psyops list updated. Boss, maybe you realize by now, Mission but list updated. There's no other way to say it. Quiet's gone. She pulled her camo stun, stowed away on a departing chopper. After pinpointing which she took, we figured out her destination. Afghanistan. Get after her. Only you can do this. Boss, I told you this would happen. I wish I could say good riddance, but Quiet knows too much about us. We can't just leave her out there. Remember what you told me when she first got here. One of these days, we're gonna have to kill her. When the time comes, I'll pull the trigger. I'd say that time has come. Hey guys and gals, how goes it? My name is Jamor, and welcome back to Metal Gear Solid 5. I wish I sounded more excited, but I don't. Right now, it is 6.17 p.m. where I'm at. I've been playing this since a little after 3. Just to get the next part of the story unlocked. I don't like it. You know, this whole way the end of the game is set up ruined it for me. Because you saw in the last part that I couldn't figure out how to unlock more missions. Well, it turns out if you killed Quiet way back in the beginning, that would be the end of the game. With all those questions that don't make any sense. But I didn't kill Quiet. And you have to... You have to have Quiet alive as a buddy. You have to... Max out her bond. Complete all the yellow side ops. Not use anything to do with a butterfly in your little emblem. Like I have the... The Hellcat back there that I made. So no butterfly stuff back there. And... You just have to keep doing side missions and random things until they decide to give you the cutscene you just saw, which was Emric being exiled. That opens up side op number 150 where Quiet disappeared and you have to go find her. And apparently right after that is mission 45. That's where something happens. And then after that, to get the true ending, you have to do just a ton of stuff. A bunch of side missions, a bunch of the main missions, even some of the really difficult ones. You have to have your base and your FOB leveled up. You have to have your units leveled up and develop stuff and bonds and this and that and the other thing. Then you get the final mission. Thankfully, I'm actually leveled up enough for that because it's already on my list so I can play it if I wanted to. But I'm going to do this side mission to find out what happened to Quiet. I'll probably end it after this mission 
because I heard that it goes right into mission 45. I'll do a video for 45 and I'll end the video, do a third video for 46, the final mission series. Being forced to do all these side missions ruined this for me. I really don't like the way they did it. But that's enough of me rambling on. Let's get back to playing the game. Where is she? You like that wall? Yeah, it's a good wall. Don't climb. Clouds approaching. Alright, quiet, where are you, boo? Quiet isn't there. Cause you've been moved somewhere? You see any intel files lying around? Maybe. Intel file obtained. Extraction arrived at Mother Base. What's going on? Okay, a quiet exit. The hell? Boss, we've gone over the prisoner transport log you found. Quiet was grabbed by the Soviets and moved to Lamar Hate Palace. She's being held at Lamar Hate Palace. Make your way there. That was really short, we just keep going then. They lost a lot of men to her. Can't blame them for wanting payback. Why did she just let herself get captured? I think it is time you knew. Quiet was carrying vocal cord parasites. The English strain, to be precise. The third English pair, Skullface, was using her as a vector. An ace in the hole if his assassination plan failed. Yeah. I knew it, but Quiet chose not to speak. She told me the situation in Navajo, the only language to which the parasites do not react. If you found out, she could not remain among you. And yet, she refused the Wobakia treatment. Why? Because part of her still wanted revenge against you. Revenge against the boss? In order to stay here, she took a vow of eternal silence. Okay. But then, that sudden mutation showed this was not enough. As long as the parasites were inside her, she could not predict what might happen. And that's why she took off? Sacrificing herself to make sure the English strain died with her? Maybe. Or maybe she only wants to infect the world. Whatever her plan. We can't let her go free. The vocal cord parasites are the last of Skullface's legacy. It's up to us to erase it. Boss, the targets are quiet and the English strain she's carrying. Your objective is to extract her. But if worst comes to worst, she may have to be eliminated. Both her and the parasites. Oh, man. We don't know for sure what Quiet's up to. But we need to secure her ASAP. I like her. She's being held at Lamar Hate Palace. Make your way there. Let's play that tape. I think I can get him to play while I still walk. Uh oh. They put her in clothes. Can't get me happy about that. Let's see. Yep, there it is. Boss, we've gone over the prisoner transport log you found. Quiet was grabbed by Wait, the Soviet the same thing I just heard. The Palace. They lost a lot of men to her. Whoa. Can't blame I mean, I can do that. Payback. But why did she just let herself get captured? I think it is time you knew. I didn't know I could do that. That's interesting. Okay.
She ain't looking good. She looks blue. Time now, snake. This is awkward. It's only about to get killed. Yeah, that was a bad move. Crap. Jesus. Ah. Okay, we could have done without the Mike Tyson. Wait, she just said something. That's gonna hurt. Oh! Yeah, quiet. I'm gonna have to check back on. Oh crap! I'm gonna have to check back on that. I think she broke her leg. She did it that hard. Holy crap! Buddy, you should have just played dead. Oh, she's got her gun. Thumbnail. It's a great pose. Here's my Grom. I like that rocket launcher. She wasn't. Heads up. She wasn't that nuts when she did try to kill me. This is gonna be fun. 
done. Yes! Finally, you get to blow crap up. Can do. That one down. Still going. Didn't hit me, I don't know. Supposed to load that. Airborne enemy approaching. Look out! 
Come on! Get inside, they got this tank. Missing this thing. Does he kill that guy? this thing so much. Finally! <sighs> that took forever. this TV game. She has a bruised stomach.
gonna have company. No water, no sun. Don't you dry up on me. Oh, uh, crap. Here, copy. Boss, do you know where the landing zone is? Head for the LZ. Another mechanized unit is opposing your area. Watch out. Don't let them find you. Boss! Mission info has been updated. I don't have my night vision. Enemy presence detected. The map has been updated. Leave quiet. I will find some way to get in there and smack you if you do. And you've been stuck right there. Great. Snake on ground. I command you to bite him. Do it. Cobra, whatever you were, bite him right now. Do it. Good job, Snake. The sacrifice will not be in vain. Yeah, 
Yeah, that's gonna hurt. Hey, he's awake. You didn't cut my other arm off, did you? Sounds like you can control the camera, but I can't. I'm gonna kinda tilt it a little bit. I see your thumb. That's your hand. Ahab! Okay, my arm's still there. Don't do it. Don't do it. Don't do it. The boss is with me. Ahab? Wait, who is this? Identify yourself. There's no time. Hurry! Where are you? What is your location? No, we're moving away from us. Circle back to your eight o'clock. Copy that. Guide me to your location. Oh, man. Proceed to your ten o'clock. Understood. Come back towards your one o'clock. Copy. One o'clock. Shift slightly to your left. No. Now proceed straight. 1.5 miles. Sorry, I didn't get that. Slide right. A little more. Yes, there you go. One more mile. Strong winds approaching. Quick, adjust to your right. Hey, she's really good. B. I'm gonna miss her. Left. A little left. Yes. Now hold your position and proceed straight. Half a mile to go. <sighs> Peacock, I can see you. I have a visual. There you are, Ahab. Visual confirmed. The light's over there, though, isn't it? Peacock, hurry. This way. I can't turn far enough. Jordan. Don't look at her butt. I didn't know you could be so talkative, quiet. The boss is here. Hurry, Pequot. Please. There it is. She can still be treated with that thing, can't she? What's it called? Malbakia? Walbakia? I don't want her to die. Boss! Boss! Where's, where's quiet? I gave you an anti-venom. Where's quiet? Where's quiet? I... 
We've got to go. No, now we've got to go. Where's quiet? Let's go, boys. like the controller vibrates to let me know I'm getting close. here somewhere. Okay. I have no idea. It's just the wind from this. Footprints are going this way. Is she up here? I don't see any footprints or anything. This is tough. progress. I did not choose to be quiet. I wanted to express my feelings to you. If only we shared a common tongue. Hmm. I don't like that whole disappearance. It's 
Vengeance was what drove me to them. The only language left to me, revenge. But the words we shared, no, that was no language at all. That is why I chose the language of gratitude instead and go back to silence. I am quiet. I am the absence of words. You have the results of quiet scans? Yes, as I suspected. Her entire body underwent parasite therapy. The parasites compensated for her burnt epidermis and provide her blood with oxygen through cutaneous respiration instead of pulmonary respiration. In addition, they replace the digestive organs she lost, and she receives carbohydrates through photosynthesis. Was Skullface responsible? There is no other possibility. Skullface ordered Quiet to assassinate Snake, only she got set on fire instead when he woke up in that hospital. But then Skullface revived Quiet through his parasite therapy, at the same time infecting her with the English strain. That way, even if the assassination failed again, she could still kill all of us just by coming here. That was the third English mating pair. Correction, the first and only English pair to be carried by a person. So either because she wanted to get even with Snake, or because she was working for Skullface, Quiet approached Snake again. Though in the end, for whatever reason, she did not complete her objective. Some change of heart, perhaps. We won't hear it from her. So, I'm gonna end this one here. We have one more mission to do. That'll be the true ending. Thankfully, I did enough stuff ahead of time to unlock it. But that's all for now. I hope you enjoyed. Like if you did. Subscribe for more. Helps me out a lot. And there's more on the way. But until our final episode for Metal Gear Solid, which will just be the day after I upload this one anyway, I will see you guys then. But bye for now.